guys, I don't know why I have the camera on. I don't know why I'm down here. I was upstairs in my office editing. Mary said, you come down here so we can have a discussion. <laughs> I'm nervous. So, like, the idea of turning this into my studio. Oh. And tomorrow you'll find out. Oh. You'll see the whole process. We'll do it, we'll move it all, and then you'll see so a grand like retour. A big reveal of Mary's new studio. I said grand retour. Retour. Like okay, this is before footage of the plant room, the music room, also known as the conservatory. It currently looks a bit like a jumbled mess because we have the exercise bike in the middle of the room and just this morning we pulled my vest cart in here because I wanted to try doing my vest while I did the exercise bike. It worked. So I think I'll probably continue trying that for a while and so I'm okay. See life is like this. Yes. A perfectly clear middle of the room would be ideal if you wanted to be like in a magazine but then there's real life and I'm like well I want the bike accessible so I can do it when I feel like I can and that means having it in a room that's accessible to me and I want to do my vest and my vest isn't pretty so it's just gonna be there and I'm okay with that so like function over fashion, I guess. Uh, also the hoodie, function over fashion, mm -hmm. yes. So anyway, that is part of my philosophy of rooms, <laughs> um, that I'm okay with stuff that isn't gonna look great because that's part of life. So here's the before, we have the swing. This chair was brought in during Christmas because the Christmas tree took up that space in the living room, so we had to move the chair in here. It's been nice to have in here, but we're gonna move it back to the living room. So we'll have that space open. I think we'll slide the swing over, but we'll see. Um, yes, we have this to work with. The plant stand, uh, which I've had a lot of questions. This is ordered from Amazon. It was a gift, but it was originally from Amazon. And then fiddly fig, which is really really mad at us right now so that's going well um, and I just put this guy in here because it was dripping out the bottom and then big tall cactus guy this is a fake fern nobody who goes here no live plants enjoy being over the heater vent so I thought we'll put a dead or a uh, fake plant and he obviously enjoys it there and then we have these two chairs we found these on the side of the road one of our neighbors was done with them and they were such a huge blessing to us. Like, we were so excited when we got these. <laughs> and I, I'm not sure if they're supposed to be outdoor or not, but we have loved them in here. So they've been there for a long time. And who knows, we'll see how it all rearranges. I'm excited. Mr. Sad Hibiscus is right here currently. And I just ordered a grow light, so hopefully that will help him uh, grow. All right, here's your before footage. And this is when you come in the front door. Giant dog bed in the middle of the walkway. And plant room and kitchen, etc. So that's the space we're working with. I'm excited.
Okay, I'm gonna film some footage from the corner. I'm in the very corner of the room on the exercise bike. And I just wanted to point out a few of the things that I'm loving so far. I love how this, is it called a spider plant? No, what is it called? I think it's spider plant. Spider plant, okay. How it like spills over the edge of the bookcase. I think that's just beautiful. And then I'm loving how that guy is, like he shows up really well against the wall. I really love that. And then these, all the plants around the room, big, big cactus, medium, that guy, even the hibiscus tree, these will all go outside when it's warm. Even like that guy, most of these guys, um, they'll go outside. So it's, it's going to be like an ever changing room set up but for now this is what we've got and I'm excited about it it's really fun and I'm really liking having the exercise bike in the corner for now we can always move it there's wheels we can move it I think it's so funny the wheels are from they look like they're from roller blades so this is the after for now, I feel like there has to be like an asterisk, like this is probably going to change even like in the next couple of days. <laughs> <laughs> this chair will not be staying here. We might end up using it on a porch or in another room, who knows. Musical chairs. I'm still finishing getting everything set up on my desk. So, you know, all my little accoutrements. And here is the after of the living room. We have this corner here that is somewhat of a awkward space and we move that into here we put the two chairs here on this wall and guys i don't know why but we really like having that couch on that wall it's visually not what i would love but functionally we both love it there and I think actually visually it's growing on me as well. And something about, some of you have asked, why don't we have a couch like out, a floating couch, maybe over here or even like with the fireplace. We love open spaces and so do the animals. Ollie likes to kind of run this whole gamut of the house. And so we really like having this open and not blocked off. We don't like having separate spaces of dining room, living room. We like it being one big room. So personal preference. And we love having this couch against this blue wall. It, anyways, I really like, now that we moved all Mary's art stuff out of here, we have a kind of a more cohesive living room and we got this piece of art. We got it at Michael's. It's like fabric with um, like just wood at top and bottom. And it's kind of a nice, as we go into spring, a nice floral pattern. And that's our redecorating, that's our retour of Mary's new art plant room and our rearranged a living room although it's not too rearranged and a cozy fire because 
they're saying here in North Carolina we might get some snow tonight, but we're from up north and we're like, <clears throat> the, the, it's not going to be freezing temperatures. We're probably not going to get snow. So there's that. As always, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, buddy. Don't you think we're oh, I see that too.